you, you may like to know how I first came to this country. What we'd come to do was interview, conduct a series of interviews with crippled murderers. Um, now that may not sound very relaxing company, but after the troubles of the previous day, it, uh, it felt very soothing indeed. Now these are people who, these are retired, forcibly retired murderers who, before their careers came to an end, were shot in the spine in vengeance for some other murder. These were people who, by this stage in their careers, were working in offices. All the people that we spoke to, they're all lying on beds with sisters, mothers, girlfriends, rubbing their legs, trying to get sensation back into them. Um, they'd been working in offices. What that mean? They said, I had an office job, or I was working in an office. And uh, what that amounted to was sitting by a telephone and once or twice a week, they were on retainer, once or twice a week, the telephone would ring, they'd be given a name and an address, and then they went and killed whoever it was that they'd been, been itemized for death. Um, these were terrifying men, men whom even terrifying men were frightened of, now reduced to complete impotence. Um, and of course, there were no facilities for wheelchairs in Kali. So every morning at the hospital, there would be this traffic jam of wheelchairs jostling. Um, and if they had horns and lights to flash, they would have been flashing and, and uh, honking at each other. Um, so, and we were going around the worst slums in Kali. Kali, this was in 2003, a few months into the invasion of Iraq, and Kali was still technically a more violent city than Baghdad at that stage. Uh, we went round the worst barriers. We talked to street gangs. So, so my first experience of Colombia was the absolute rock bottom of the society. Um, and my impression still is of, of a, a weak state that uh, is on the rise, as many countries in South America are, but still in the process of taming their country with a civil war, with a, with a drugs warlord system. Um, that was Cali. This is Cartagena, and it's uh, Cartagena, and it's, uh, you know, look for yourself. There are, there are slums a mile and a half away, perhaps, but this is one of those little uh, nuclei of civilization and, and beauty. Um, you know, my impression is of great of physical beauty. Look, look at the, the position of Colombia on the atlas. There it stands with one shoulder in the Atlantic, one shoulder in the Pacific, cut in half by the equator. It's, it's a sort of blessed, magical place. Um, but in a quite early convulsion of the evolution of a, of a nation state. 